So basically, uh, this die is spring-loaded. You would insert your bullet and then press down on it to cut and then uh, release and you, you've got a good bullet. So, uh, here we have our bullet that's uh, our shortest one that we found. Let's turn this on. Push it down and there's no contact to the cutter. So we'll turn this in a little bit. And I don't know if you can hear it, but the tip is being cut right here. And there we have it. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but you can see the tip was just touched with the cutter. So that's the length we want our bullets to be. Lock the ring down. And basically that's it. We just start cutting. Slip them in, push them down, and you'll feel it. Just takes the tip off. You know, most of them you're only going to take off a, a thousandth or two. Some of them you may hit a little bit more, so it might take a little bit. There we go. That one took a little bit. You can see the longer ones, you just got to kind of finesse them in there. There we go. So this is the extent of basically my bullet trimming. It's not glamorous by far. But again, the purpose of this will be to make sure that at the end of this each bullet should be within a thousandth of an inch in length all right if we can get that and i'll show you on my next video when uh, we go through this one is giving me a little bit of a problem there once it catches you're fine. So I'll go through and I'll uh, I'll cut all these tips and then uh, my next video I'll show you as you'll see that now that these tips are cut you'll s it kind of messes with the uh, with the point of them. So the next process and the final process will be to Retip that point and the bullet will be good to go. So, if you found this informative, you like these, give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe, leave a comment, and uh, we'll catch you next time.